Ahaz was the son of Jotham. Jotham had actually been one of the decent kings of Judah. On the outside, this next king Ahaz might have come off as quite righteous. However, from scripture, we find that the nice, pious outer shell covered up one of the most wicked, idolatrous kings that Judah had ever had. In this skit, Ahaz is represented by Pastor Owen playing the role of Aiden. Aiden isn't a king, but the modern day son of a mayor. His friend's name is Isabel, simply because it starts with an I like <laughs> Isaiah, the prophet, and this part is played by Clara. Monday. Aiden, man, you're looking pretty worn down. You all right? You know what? Living under the pressure of being the mayor's son, you know, not everybody can deal with that, if you know what I mean. I mean, most people would not be able to understand the kind of weight and pressure that that puts on a person. So, it's good who I am who I am. You know what I mean? Like, like a forgiven sinner and a child of God? Uh, um, uh, I was thinking more like spiritual warrior, you know, I think, I think that would be more along the lines of what we're talking here, like, I don't know, maybe self-made, talented soldier of God, you know, hashtag blessed, that's me, man, you know, not everybody can do it, but yeah. You can't be serious. Okay. You are. Have a good day, Aiden. <laughs> yeah. See you, man. Tuesday. Oh, hey, Aiden. Aiden? Shh! Can't you th see the sign? I'm meditating. Oh, oh, oops. Just thought I'd give you a good word about where things left off yesterday. No need for that, man. I'm deep. I'm deep into this. Okay, good for you. Prayer is a good thing. Oh. What I'm doing is way more than praying. I am visualizing. I am conjuring. I am envisioning. Meditation is what I'm talking about. Oh. What are you praying, uh, meditating about? Uh, well, that, that's personal, you know. Uh, I, you know what? I could share more about my amazing spiritual discipline on my Instagram account. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which reminds me, you know what? Could you take a picture, of, take a few pics. Yeah, go right over there. Yeah, get the Bible, candles, coffee in the background. Yeah, the whole ambiance. Perfect. All right. You got I, Yeah, you, I got oh, it. You got a few. I got okay. a few. Yeah. Well. Okay. See you tomorrow, man. Yeah. <laughs> Wednesday. Whoa. Look who's doing something weird for everybody to see again. Big surprise here. <sighs> 974, 75. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Already read it a couple times mm -hmm. this morning. So, <laughs> time to get the mind and the body right, if you know what I mean. You know what? Gotta get the body right with the old B I B E L E Bible biceps, muscles for my man, the Messiah. Yeah, that's right. Better get the try, the tries for the triune God. The triune God. That's what I'm talking about. The triceps. Ooh, feel that burn. Yeah, all powerful, all mighty. That's what I'm becoming. Faith that gets stronger, stronger and stronger. Oh, yeah, man. yeah. That's right. There is so much idolatry around this whole scene that I don't know where to start. Oh, start, beginning, end, alpha, omega. 
know all about that. <laughs> I'm leaving. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Thursday. Hey, Aiden, you, you want a piece of this? Oh, uh, <laughs> no thanks, Isabel. It's fasting day for your favorite spiritual <laughs> warrior. Yep, going through the whole suffering and hungering thing so that I know exactly what Christ was feeling, you know? That's what it is today. You know, Aiden, I'm just gonna ask you this simple question. Yeah, shoot. That group of guys over there, uh, they're missing something, not feeling good. Wonder if you'd wanna go over there with me? Oh. <laughs> Those guys? I'm kinda built different, you know? Oh. I don't know that I'm really for that crowd over there. You know what, but wait. I have evangelizing on my list of Christian superpowers, you know? It's on the to-do list for today. You know what? All right, let's do this. Okay. Deep, all right. Deeply problematic motivations, but let's go. Hey, dudes. Son of the mayor here. <laughs> Let's be honest, they probably, you probably knew that, didn't you? Uh, yeah, Aiden's the name, Christianity is the game. Want to be in the cool group? Just do it, right now. Decide for Christ. Hear the good news that you're awesome, especially if you follow my lead. Aiden, be repented and stop right there. Guys, I'm sorry about this, but I've got to say something. Aiden, I know you're not asking God for this. You're, you're not asking me to do what I'm about to do, or for anything that really matters. You're not even interested in what God is willing to do for you. But He's given me the keys, and I'm going to let it fly, and let the Holy Spirit do what He does. Um, okay. God is a giver. It was his decision and his work. The promise and news of his gospel is not up to you. God came to the earth to take your sins away from you and give you his righteousness. He died on the cross because of you and me, but also for you and me. He was raised to give you a new life with his word and God doesn't lie to you. Your sins and all of your idolatry, including the worship of yourself and your abilities, are forgiven on account of Christ. Open your ears, that is the gospel. He forgives you for thinking your disciplines and deeds would merit some favor, simply, instead of simply believing the word he speaks for you. That word, the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ, is for you too.